Bongiorno. Three twenty-five and ticking down in the fourth. And he gets knocked down and the ball is loose. You know, when you get old in life, things get taken from you. I mean that's that's a part of life. But you only learn that when you start losing stuff. You find out life's just a game of inches. And so is football. I'm going to tell you right now that this team will be compromised entirely of winners. Luckily for you, I'm very f***ing good at my job. Or I'd be out of one. You guys are the new blood. You are the future big swinging dicks of this team and of this organization. Let me tell you what's required. You're required to work your fucking asses off. Anyone thinks I'm superficial or materialistic, you can leave now and go fucking job at McDonald's because that's where you belong. I'm going to tell you right now, the last person who crossed me, well, just see for yourself. Joe, I'm going to talk real slow so that Greg and John can follow along with us. 18 touchdowns, 13 interceptions, and 3,000 yards. Sounds like Lamar Jackson is going to be taking over your starting position next year. Thank God I had Le'Veon and Todd Gurley this season. They carried me to the playoffs. That $100 would have been a worse investment than giving it to Eric and Buck to start Amethyst. A few years ago, you won a Super Bowl. You told your teammates that you were the best quarterback in the league. Now, that statement's about as bold as Walker Hogan's resume, and about as honorable as John Armstrong's diploma. Joe, I've been dying to know, how'd you get that Super Bowl MVP? Pass interference calls? We both know your departure from Baltimore is coming soon, and I would bet that it's going to look similar to Lucas's departure from Bassinol. The three eye Ravens back. Yeah.